Hi there guys and welcome back to another RuneScape video. This one is going to be a review and a bit of testing on the new Majra Aura that came out with the Gold Premium Membership Package for 2016. You can purchase this package for either 24 bonds in game or which cost me around 340 mil which is what I chose to do or around uh, 65 pounds or GBP that is uh, for RL money. Now this aura has two versions. It has a standard version which can be used once a day which just gives a plus 5% damage to all styles. But then the, the other version of it, which is the one I'm testing out here, is the Berserker version and that gives you plus 50% damage to any style uh, at wherever you are. The problem with this second version, which is on the same aura, you just have to right click it and it's sort of a second option down, is that you can only use this 50% boost once a month which makes it quite rare and basically you can only use it 12 times for the whole whole aura. I decided to test my first one for this month at Virago in a 5 man. Just wanted to see what it hit, it was quite a lot of fun to use and just kind of wanted to experiment a little bit with the damage caps etc. Now as you'll see throughout the three clips here, the first thing I decided to do was get max XP, so that's 26.6 on P2 without using a single sun or meta, so just threshing the whole phase, which seemed to be pretty easy. Uh, I then proceeded to obviously on every, I did this on all five, so we, I did manage to get five Rago kills in the one aura in a five man. And the next thing you'll see me do is we uh, have it's we're on Scott week, and I basically managed to hit extremely hard on the Scots in a meta so I hit about 5 to or 6 10ks which is the damage cap on a Scopidus which is pretty cool. This made for really quick kills and seeing as we were 5 man it basically meant that me and one other person would just go on one Scop and the other three people including the bomb tank would go on the other and we were pretty much even if not done before them which yeah it's pretty OP in my opinion. The last clip in this video you'll see is me getting max XP on P4. Now P4 normally to get max XP is extremely difficult, um, I've, I've only ever got it a few times and it relies on extreme just RNG and massive hits, however in this clip you see that because of the aura I hit up to sort of 9k Dragon Breast and I actually get an 11 plus crit on my last tendril hit which is pretty outstanding. So what's the point in this aura, a lot of people have been asking you know is it worth it buying the gold membership package and there's a lot of sort of factors that I think you have to take into account. I certainly wouldn't you know buy the gold membership package just for this aura. It is good, it, it does hit very well but it's once a month and it's pretty it is fun to use but you know long and short of it you get an hour out of it every month so that's one thing to bear in mind. So what's my verdict on this? Is it worth using it Rago? Yeah, I mean, if you want to have some fun and you don't really have anywhere else where you're struggling to get kills, um, then yeah, go for it. It's, it is pretty cool and seeing massive hits does, you know, speed phases up occasionally, especially phase three this week, you can really hit extremely hard. Other than that, there's not really much else or point to the aura. I will be trying and testing it at lots of other places throughout the year and hopefully we'll make uh, videos on, you know, where it's best. Uh, please do let me know in the comment section if you've bought the gold membership and whether you think if you've tried the aura yourself let me know what you think of it or where you tried it and what the results of it are and I hope to see you in the next one.